everybody, it's Mermaid Lana here doing my first video review of my Mermaid's Party's tail. It is the second tail I've received from her, from Stevie at Mermaid Parties, and I wanted to do something a little different besides bombard you with a kajillion photos. So here's my review of the tail. So I'm going to flip this over and you guys can see. Here we go. So right now you're seeing the back of my tail. Um, Stevie did a good job. She, uh, I love how the fringe is, so I'm going to bring this a little closer so you can see. Um, she used a new technique on my, fl uh, fringe dorsal fin. Um, hopefully, uh, it'll work out and it'll stay, because I know she was having a couple of issues with fringe, and personally, I'm really, really crazy about this fringe. I don't know, I could sit here and pet this fringe all day. Um, <laughs> but no, I really do like it, and I think she, uh, I like the new technique. It, it's very strong, very tough. Um, as you can see here, she did paint, uh, my waist a dark blue that fades into a light blue, which is great. The entire tail is neoprene and latex, and since this is latex, she painted the neoprene and then did the layer of latex and scaling over it, which is actually great because if something happens, you can, uh, n well, nothing will happen to the paint job, just the latex, which is okay, and you can see the scales, how little and delicate they are. <laughs> so here's the heel fin, same thing, locked on, everything is good. And um, here, in this fluke, in the mermaid fluke, is a Finnis Wave Monofin. I've actually used a Finnis Wave once before. It's been quite a while since I've used one, but in here is the Finnis Wave Monofin. And it's very, very strong because I literally, it's kind of a little heavy, nothing big. Tail weighs probably about five, six pounds, nothing big. Um, I am definitely going to show you the opposite side, so you can see what I'm doing, you can see the belly, so, Ooh. okay, there we go, so, hold on one second, let me pick it up, here we go, and of course I put it farther than I expected, <laughs> um, so like I said, there's neoprene inside of it, it's, uh, not too heavy neoprene, which is good. Once again, there is the the blue that fades into the light blue, all the way down. There sure is a little crease, I mean, uh, the, um, what do you call it, seams, but it doesn't bother me. And the thinnest wave starts right here, right here. You can see the outline, nothing big. Um, this is, like I said, my second Mermaid Party's tail. Uh, I bought one previously, and there were some issues pertaining to the paint flicking off, which is, which led, uh, Stevie to do a, to use a new technique. Actually, if you see right here, I'm trying to hold this and do the mon, uh, check the monofin at the same time. Okay, here it is. See these little itty bitty, tiny little hole thingies right here? This is to let water out as you swim, so that way nothing bubbles up in the monofin. Uh, in the tail, excuse me. And, um, like I said previously, uh, the small issue we had in the beginning was that the paint was painted over the latex. And when I went for my practice swim, I had silver latex flowing, little specks of silver flowing in the, uh, in the pool. <laughs> so... She used this technique, and I'm actually very happy the way this came out. And I don't know if you can see it, but uh, there are little itty bitty rays. See them? You can actually feel them as well. I like this. Um, she uh, used this technique, and I think it's actually worked out really, really well for her. And uh, I definitely, definitely want to use... Um, I definitely want to... Um, when she starts her silicone line, I'm most likely going to order a silicone tail from her. Because I really do like the way she does customer service and also how she makes her tails. And this is a custom design because, well, I wanted uh, something different. 
Uh, I was actually going to remake the other tail, and I decided on this one, which I'm actually happy with. And um, I like that I really do, so you can see it from here to there. Um, I can't thank her enough for all the work she's done on this tail. I mean, she's been seriously patient with me. And... <laughs> And she, she took time, quite a bit of time, but that's okay. I, I mean, art takes time, technically speaking, and so do tails. And um, as you see from my side here, uh, there you go. Okay, well, let me flip this back over, and I can bring you guys in so you can see me. Okay, here I am, <laughs> and all my things are on. Excuse me, please excuse me, because I'm only on two hours of sleep. And one very big cup of coffee. <laughs> and um, Stephanie, or rather Stevie, makes, uh, she makes fabric tails. She makes, this is actually latex and neoprene with silicone. And uh, soon she'll be making a silicone only line, which is pretty cool. But um, if you want a fabric tail or a latex tail at a decent price, you can actually go to, like I said, mermaidpartiesandtails.com or facebook.com slash mermaidparties, which, uh, that's their site. You can also email them at mermaidparties at gmail.com. Um, I think, uh, if you really want it a decent price tail, I definitely go with, uh, Stevie. Um, she, uh, since she has the wave monofin, um, you can also get the Oceanica monofin, or Murfin, uh, and what was the other one? The Churchill uh, fins, which are pretty good. All these come with straps. The one that I had just had a custom-made uh, tail, kind of like the Mermagica tail, and uh, I personally like the wave better. So this one, this tail, I'm very happy with. Uh, I can't thank you, her enough. And like I said, I'm gonna put it down in the bottom where you can see the description in the description. The links where you can go to mermaid parties and order your own tail. It can be custom. It can have as many fins as you want. You can have you can have a shark fin, or you can have stripes, or purple and pink, and a whole bunch of other things. So, guys, I'm going to let you go since tomorrow is a big day. Uh, I will definitely be putting up more video since I have the Mer Friend meetup over in Coney Island, and uh, hopefully you guys will see me in tail. And I hope to see you guys soon.